Hey, what is going on guys, this is Boy Crane here, bringing you more Terraria 1.2 with Crane, and in this episode we are going to continue where we left off in the last episode, where we got a bunch of stuff done, and we actually got to a point where I'm, I'm like, we really have to fight Skeletron in this episode, because it's really the only logical step we have to take, because last episode I was actually looking, that's a superhero zombie, I have never seen that before in my whole entire life, anyways, uh, yeah, we have to fight Skeletron in order to get access to the dungeon, and the dungeon is gonna open up a bunch of opportunities, but in order to fight Skeletron, I need a little bit more health, and the way I'm gonna get that health is that we're gonna go to this cave. If you guys remember from the beginning of the series, this is actually the first cave I actually got to, which is pretty cool because, as you can see, there's like ropes everywhere from when I tried to get out and stuff, and it brings back a, lo a lot of like good memories and stuff. By the way, this lip grass blade or whatever, pretty OP. Another thing I have to do, but that's after the dungeon in my opinion, is make a elevator and go down to hell, see if I can get some good stuff over there and get prepared. I mean, I, I need a shadow key, and in order to get the shadow key, I need, I think I need to get to the dungeon, so that's only the logical step. Another thing I have to do is, uh, yeah, build a elevator, uh, make a lot of wooden platforms and start preparing for when I try to beat the wall of flesh. Uh, also, I need to find a beehive, I need to make another world so I can kill the, um, the goddamn brain. Because I, re I really do want to show a fight with the brain. It's extremely fun. Uh, one thing we did get in the last episode was this here water bolt. And that is going to open up a bunch of good opportunities for us, guys. That is a great weapon. And we also got a water candle. Did I not come over here? I'm pretty sure I did. Oh yeah, I came through the water. Okay, that makes sense. Um, I remember when I used to be really scared of this area because I only had a boomerang. That was really funny. Now I'm like extremely OP compared to this... To this area here. I am gonna pick up a bunch of uh, glowing shrooms in the hopes that I can make some uh, shine potions because shine potions are really gonna help me especially in the dungeon where I don't want to be lighting shit up because the angry bones and the cursed skulls and stuff they will kill me if I try to be dumb and just do that. So we did get a little bit of shrooms uh, I think we just have to farm some day bloom now and I don't really care too much about the healing potions I mean I do I really should but since the potion sickness is so long, I think I only need a couple of those. What the fuck are those? Something healed me and I have no idea what that what that was. That's fine though. We're gonna get some more shrooms here. If I get some leftovers, I'll just use them for potions and stuff. So that's that's always cool. I love uh, the shroom farms. I like the background. It's cool. I mean, the music is great. It's basically the cave's music. I like I like the music a lot. I really have my music turned down a lot on my on my headset, so I don't really hear it too much. But I do love Terraria music a bunch. It's really one of the best soundtracks I've ever heard. It's just great. I like it a lot. Also, I need to decorate my house a little bit more because it's looking a little bit ugly. Let's be honest here. I'm gonna get rid of the water candle because I don't need to sp spawn any enemies, and I'm gonna replace that with this here, this here torch. How did I get down there before? What the fuck? The skeletons look really weird. I think there was an update to Terraria. I think this is 1.2.1 now. Which maybe they fixed a lot of things and add, added a lot of reskins. That's the only thing I can think of really. Maybe a lot of reskins. That would make sense, I guess. Uh, this is the way down, okay. Let me switch back to my, gra to my grass blade. Because grass blade OP. How, much, how many shrooms do I have? I have 35 of them. I think that's enough for a couple healing potions. Pretty sure. Uh, thing is, when you get to hell, healing potions, you don't really even have to make them. Because they're so common, right? This one. Anyways, we have to go down a little bit more. Because this is a cave where I found all my life crystals. And I'm really in the hopes of finding a little bit more of those. So, fingers are crossed for that. Uh, let's see if I can get something else going on here. Oh god. Okay. Uh, I don't take fall damage. I was thinking of my other character because I'm, I'm playing like a single player series on myself. I have a multiplayer character, I have my let's play character and I have my single player character. I just love this game so much and there's so much stuff I don't know that I just want to like explore and get to know all the different stuff. It's fun. The game is really fun. One of my favorite th things about exploring in games and that's something you guys really need to know about me is that I like to explore a lot. For example, in a, in a game like Dark Souls that I'm also playing for my channel and I know I haven't updated that in a while but yeah, for in a game like Dark Souls, I really like that there's no like linear storyline, that you can just make up your own story for the game. I mean, I, I know the developers had something planned for the story and stuff. What the fuck is up with the skeleton? Like, look at that shit! He's dressed like an astronaut. He's dead though. Because I don't like him. How did, how did I even get in there? Okay. 
Uh, so yeah, I, I like non-linear storylines that make you think. Like, take a game for example, like that game that came out not too long ago, that in the game, the Stanley Parable. That is a game that makes you think a lot. And I like thinking a lot in games, because it makes you, it develops your creativity in a way that most games don't do. And there's a life crystal right there, so I'm, there's two of them. See, this is what I mean, this cave is like filled with life crystals. And all other caves in the world, in my world at least, are just empty. They have none. I think I have the same health I had when I first left this uh, freaking cave. Maybe a little bit more. I really like the freaking red skin. I mean, uh, red skins of the skeletons. I really like them. I think they're really good. Okay, well, let's eat that. I don't really quite need uh, max health. What the fuck? Okay, there you go. I forgot I didn't have my, my thing on the tox bar. Alright, life crystal. It might be a little bit dark because I have the the lightning thing on. I like it a lot. It's a good it's a good thing. I like it. Alright, how many shrooms? We have 43. We have a decent amount of them. I like it a lot. Oh god. Something stepped on that. Did I? I don't know. Let me get those shrooms. I am gonna kill this Kelly's. Kill this Kelly's. I'm gonna keep looking for some life crystals. I need at least two more, I think. Because they have a decent armor. I mean my my armor's fine. I think I'll survive. Oh, thank God. Hello, sir. Yes, uh, do I have enough? How much is that? That's 10 freaking gold. I mean, I have enough for the rocket boots and the Tinker's Workshop because I think I have like 30 gold on my chest. But I really don't want to spend all my gold on that because I still have stuff to buy. I need to buy the mini shark if I want to make the mega shark anytime. I also need to buy, I mean, I need gold to reforge if I want to get better prefixes. I don't know. There's a lot of stuff I have to make. This used to be like the biggest cave in my world, which is really weird because it is the first cave I, I found. We also need to get a little bit more gold if I want to spawn the, uh, the king's slime, which I do. We need to make a gold crown and then combine that with a bunch of gel. And that's that. Okay, uh, 69 torches. I'm really reluctant to use another one, but I mean, we're going to have to use it eventually. I like 69. It's a, it's a nice number. Red husk, that's a red dye. I really need to get my bee suit, so I think I'm gonna have to farm the bee for that, the queen bee. Because that is my favorite vanity suit. That's the one I have on my multiplayer series and I want a pink one. So that's that, maybe a blue one. They all look pretty nice, I like the bee suit a lot, the shirt is probably my favorite piece. The helm is nice because it has like little little things on its face, on the head, I forgot what they're called. In English, I'm sorry, not my, fav not my first language, it really isn't. Some people actually don't believe me when I say that, that was a boulder. Anyways, so yeah, some people don't believe me when I say English is not my first language. It, it is not, and you can tell that. You can tell that by how much I fuck up simple words. And by how much I just... Yeah, I fuck up stuff in general. I really do. Anyways, uh, this is turning out to be really nice. Like, we have gotten a bunch of advantages here. We've gotten a lot of shrooms, so I can... That is so cool, man. All these skellies. They look so cool. This is lava, by the way. Do I have an obsidian skull? I do. I do still need to get to grab some more obsidian, cause it, that is required to make a uh, hellstone, which is something we eventually want to do. I don't want a hellstone armor or a molten armor, but I do want to get a phoenix blaster. And for that, uh, first I'm gonna have to go to the dungeon and find a uh, a handgun. But it's still cool, man. Like I like it. All right, there's some amethyst here. I might as well just grab it. I think I'm just gonna sell it, cause I really have no use for it. The only gem I really have use for is a uh, diamond. Because with diamond you can make, uh, whatchamacallit, you can make whatchamacallit, yes. No, you can make uh, the, the thing, the fucking diamond robe, yes, thank you. God damn, oh god. Stop shooting me, pieces of shit. Uh, hell is also really filled with, um, with life crystals, so if I get to hell from over here, which we're pretty close to be honest, let me, let me check the map. No, we're still pretty far away. Yep, we're pretty far away, it's fine. That's fine. This is just the beginning of lava, I guess. We are gonna drain this lava and try to get some more obsidian just because we're here already, so I might as well. Uh, there you go, drain that. That's gonna turn that into obsidian. Then I'm gonna drain this and it's gonna turn everything else into obsidian. How am I burning? I don't understand what's going on. Anyways. Oh god. The boulder traps, man. They can get you. They will get you. Uh, let me get some more gold just to be sure I can make the crown. Maybe we'll fight the King's Lime on this episode and maybe Skeleton too, I don't know. I'm planning to make like a, a one hour session and maybe divide it into four episodes or something like that because last two I made a half an hour each and I, I think it's a little bit too long for a Terraria episode. 
I know some people like long episodes, some people like shorter episodes. I don't really have a preference, but I mean, I don't know. It's a thing. It's a thing people like. Longer episodes or shorter episodes. People have their own opinions on that. I have mine. I like longer episodes, so for the most part, but I, I realize there's people who don't, don't have the attention span to be watching the same thing for over an hour. Unless it's like a movie or something like that, and I'm pretty sure my content is not as good as, say, a uh, Chris Nolan movie. It really isn't. Batman is great. I love that movie. Anyways, I uh, love placing torches, by the way. It lights up the map, it's good. Uh, I think this is the end of the cave, and I do not have a magic mirror still. Unbelievable, we didn't find one chest. At least we found two life crystals, which I feel comfortable with. And we're really not close to lava. I'm gonna drink. I'm gonna dig down just a little bit down. Dig down just a little bit down. Thank you, English, for being so easy. See if we can find a bigger extension of the cave, which we see. It seems we did at least a little bit. The die trader has arrived. I really. Okay, I mean, I need him if I want to get my ping thing. But I really don't care too much about him. He looks funny, I like him a lot. I like his design. I like the design of the Diet Trader. It's really fun. I mean, the merchant, the original NPCs, they're fine. The one I like the most about the original ones is probably the Riot. But other than that, I really like the Diet Trader, I, I really like the Tinker. Uh, the, the, the girl you rescued at the dungeon, I forgot her name. Yeah, I like them a lot. Let's see, I have 63 gold. Uh. I have 23 gold ore. Do I want to keep fucking with this cave? I don't, I don't think I'm gonna find any more life crystals. I'm gonna dig down until I find another cave extension. If that's empty, then I'll just go back, kill myself. Maybe on lava. Well, that was easy enough. There's something around here, so. Oh god, this is gonna take a while to mine through. The dynamic lightning, by the way, it makes everything look a little bit weird. Cause the lightning, yeah, it's like it has colors and it looks a little bit more realistic, but it also makes everything a little bit darker, which I'm not sure I like too much. I don't know. I mean, lightning—it's something weird about games. Lightning is like one of those aspects you always have to take into account. Cause if a game is dark, it gives you ambience and stuff. Like scary games need to be dark and stuff like that. They can be all bright and stuff. But in games like this, where you don't really know. I mean, the genre is not that clear. I mean, it is a sandbox game and stuff like that. But I don't really, I don't really know. Okay, I, I think I'm just gonna kill myself by this point. There is an amethyst right there, but I don't really care too much about gems right now. All right, let's kill ourselves. I know this might be a little bit annoying, just me killing myself over and over. But I think it would be a little bit more annoying if I were to like walk back. I really need to find the magic mirror. Really, what I have to find. Also, more mana would be great. But it's not nighttime. There's a Tinker. Okay, let me get my gold out of the chest. Uh, where's my gold? Okay, 22 gold. Ah, that's actually barely enough. I am gonna buy the rocket boots. I'm gonna buy the workshop. You. Shop. This. Place here. Uh, rocket boots, yes. Uh, get rid of the ankle of the wind. Get rid of the anglet. Get rid of the boots. Get rid of the log. I actually can combine everything I have on right now. That's actually pretty fun. Uh, let's see. I can make uh, an obsidian horseshoe. I can make specter boots. And then I can make lightning boots. Perfect. And now we can get some stuff out of the chest and just equip that. Okay. That's why I wanted this guy to come to move in. That is actually huge. Because now I'm faster and I can fly. Let's see. What else do we have that we can equip here? Uh, we can put on a band of regen. A band of star power just to have a little bit more mana. And I'm guessing... Do we really need flippers? Like, I could put on the flippers? I mean, yes. I guess. Like, I don't have anything better to put in. What can I combine the flippers with? Uh, where's the guide? What can I combine the flippers with? I have no idea. Uh, flippers here. You can make a diving gear if you have a diving helmet. Ah, I mean, I have no idea where to find that, so. Uh, we can craft gold bars. I'm pretty sure at least. This is so slow, I really should be using the the look function on this. Uh, I'm pretty sure we have some right here, yes. Can I make a crown? I cannot. Son of a bitch. Oh, how many do you need for a golden crown? Like, that's fine. Alright, quick stack. The gold bars. Uh, put the gold back here because I don't need it right now. 
Uh, red husk goes in the dai, which is right here. Uh, let's see, quick stack. I don't really need this. I'm going to put the blink running here. Uh, this use seeds. I might as well. I have seven day bloom. And I actually had a bunch of glowing motion. So let's make some shine potions, shall we? Let me get the bottle of water. Make some shine potions. As many as I can. There you go. Shine. And healing potions. There you go. 30 of them. Can I make any more? Yes, I can. That's actually really nice. Alright. Got a bunch of healing potions. I think we're ready to go fight Skeletron, to be honest. I mean, I cannot fight the slime right now. Which is a little bit sad. But one thing I am going to do is I'm going to turn all this wood into platforms. That's a thing I did want to do. And make a, like a little bit of arena. A little bit of an arena that we're going to be able to fight little Skeletron in. 99, I think it's going to be fine. So Let's just use all the Spectre Boots that we have right now to double jump all the way up to the thing. Is it even this way? I always get confused, by the way. Yeah, it is. Okay. I love the map, by the way. The map, the map function is one of my favorite things from 1.2. Like, they added a bunch of items and all that good stuff. But this map, man. So good. By the way, once we get to hard mode, first priority. Actually, since we're going to farm the bee, that is one thing I do want to do. Uh, since we're going to farm, farm the goddamn bee, we could actually just get a bunch of gold. And maybe if we get a witch doctor, which, I mean, we know where the entrance to the dungeon thing is. The hard mode dungeon, that is. We know where that is. So we can get a witch doctor. And the witch doctor is going to allow me to buy leaf wings. And leaf wings are probably the best wings you can get right now. I know there are steampunk wings and there are developer wings, but you, I don't think you can get any of those. I mean, maybe in 1.2.1 you can get steampunk wings because the steampunker might sell them. But I mean, the leaf wings are like the greatest. I love them so much. They're so good. Anyways, let's go to the dungeon. We're gonna construct a little arena I wanted to construct. Then we're gonna try to kill Skeletron. It would be really... I mean, the water bolt is gonna help. Don't get me wrong, the water bolt, the water bolt is gonna help a lot. I uh, really don't want the, the meteorite. I should farm some, just in order to make a farm. But I don't really wanna do it right now. I wanna focus on what I'm doing. I wanna go to the dungeon, uh, construct a little... It's not even an arena, it's like a walkway, really. Oh, pink dye. That's pink dye, right there. There you go. So I have one. I have made, by the way, a uh, pink bee, bee suit before, so no need to worry about that. I really do like that I have both region stuffs, because that is going to help me a lot. Uh, what kind of potions do I have? I don't have any buff potions, so that's a little bit bad. But it's going to be fine, okay. So the way we want to do this is we want to come right here, and we, we want to start building like right this. Because uh, on the old dungeon, like on 1.1, there used to be like a little flat area right here, and that would make it so you could fight Skeletron in an easy place. But now, uh, that is not such luck, so... We're gonna have to do this, which is completely fine. I mean, I have a bunch of Shine Potions, I'm gonna use one. Uh, just so I can light stuff up. That is also gonna allow me to just run through this place without having to, like, go into this little chasm here. So that's fine. I have... F oh god. Give me those back. I need those. I also want to make a better pickaxe. The one thing I need health stone for is to make a molten pickaxe. Because molten pickaxe is just the best, really. It's the best pickaxe you can get in easy mode. It really is. It's flat out the best thing you can get. Alright, let me get more wood. Uh, craft a bunch more of these. I think 10 should be enough. Maybe not. I mean, that's close enough, but I kind of want to complete this. There you go, just like so. I have one left, I'm just gonna get rid of that. Uh, icons I don't need. Uh, let's see, Let, I'm just gonna clear my inventory because I might as well. Let's see, how is this gonna work? Am I just gonna shoot him with water bolts? I think I might until I run out. Then I'll just either leaf grass blade. Blade of grass. I, ca I have been calling it wrong the whole time. Alright, it's not nighttime yet, so I might as well just explore a little bit. I mean, I know what's on this side of the world. Where, where are those? Pumpkins? What the fuck? Pumpkins? Can I make pumpkin pie? Is that something that was added because of Halloween? It would be really nice if the king slime were to spawn. It really would. I might as well just farm some meteorite, right? Like, that would be... okay. I am gonna get as much pumpkin as I can. Maybe I can make, like, a Halloween costume. 
like skeleton custom, something like that. I'm gonna mo I'm gonna farm uh, 50 of this while I'm here. I think I have a bunch on my chest actually, but I mean it's not nighttime and I might as well, right? Like, what's the point of not grabbing the meteorite when you can? I need 50 of it, only 50. Because I don't wanna build I don't wanna build a suit. I don't wanna build a lifesaver, a lightsaber, I should say. A lifesaver. What the fuck am I talking about? And I don't want to build uh, the thing. I don't want to build uh, a space gun. Because the space gun sucks unless you have the suit. And even then, it's not the greatest uh, range weapon of all time. I was thinking about making this character a range thing. But I kind of want magic better. Because I have, I kind of have a plan for hard mode. I do. Alright, 51. That's that's that. I really love the Spectre's boot, the lightning boots, by the way. Because they make you run so much faster. Like, look at this shit. This is so much faster than it used to be. Uh... Can I build anything with the pumpkin? I can make pumpkin workbench. Are you kidding me right now? This is the best day of my life. This is the best goddamn day of my life. All right, I'm done. I got pumpkin. I'm done. No more terraria. That's that. That's it. I got pumpkin. Can I make pumpkin spice coffee? Oh, I really wish. That's so good. I don't know if you guys have ever tried pumpkin spice coffee, like in Starbucks or something like that. Man, I don't know if you guys know this, but Colombia is actually renowned for its uh, coffee. Like, the best coffee in the world considered for Turkey, Brazil, or Colombia. And we make such a good blend of pumpkin spice coffee, man. It's so good. Like, I like my coffee dark, but the pumpkin spice coffee just has a really, a really special place in my heart. It really does. You know what I should have done? Instead of equipping the goddamn flippers? Shiny red balloon. I, why didn't I think of that? Shiny red balloon is such a better option. Alright. I love this music, by the way. This is the best music. You have a bunny mask, and you die. Can I get the bunny mask? I really love what they did with the skins. I really do. It's so good. Do I get pumpkin seeds? That's the other question. Do I get pumpkin seeds? Doesn't seem like it. So I cannot make like a pumpkin farm? That That's bullshit. Maybe it's a rare drop. I would love to get pumpkin seeds. Because, man, a pumpkin workbench is, like, the best thing that's ever happened to me. Is that... No. That, that was not, uh... Daybloom. I like Day Daybloom. It's a good thing. It's a good thing that everyone needs to get. I like Daybloom. I also like meteor heads. They're really good for farming souls, as I have mentioned a billion times. Spectre boots or lightning boots in the... Oh, you are so bunny! Give me that bunny mask. I really want a bunny mask. You're stuck. Alright then, I guess I died here, there's a, a tomb over there, a tombstone. Is it, day is it night time already? I think it's close, but not quite. Let me get the table. I'm gonna use that to make shine potion. Shine potion is really important, as I have mentioned a billion times now. Eh? Oh man, this health situation, I don't know about it, man. Also sucks that you can't place torches on this uh, kind of stuff, but I am gonna use a shine potion, so it's not a big deal. Really isn't. Is that? No, that's not a pumpkin. Okay, it's night time. Uh, let's summon it. Try the water bolt, I guess. Hello, zombie. Yes. To get the fuck out. I don't have a cobalt shield, which is one of the worst situations. Alright, that's that. Let's leaf blade grass it up. Or grass blade, I should say. You're rolling. I see you rolling. They see me rolling. They hate him. All right, I have my normal potions. Let me put that shine potion up just so I can see a little bit better. All right, not taking that much damage. If I can get rid of the hands, this fight would be a million times easier, by the way. And the hands don't really have that much health. I mean, they're pretty easy to get rid of. I mean, this fight might be a little bit of a hassle. I'm, I'm aware of that. Don't worry about it. I really like the water bolt, by the, by the way. It's one of my favorite spells on easy game. I really wish I had um, a crimson rod, but the only way to get that is by going to the crimson and destroying a heart. And I don't have any crimson in this world. So that sucks a little bit. Let's, uh, let's shoot him a little bit, shall we? I mean, we have a bunch of weapons we can use. I think this skeleton fight is going to go just fine, since it's not going to turn daytime anytime soon. So I don't think I'm going to die because of that. Uh, let me get rid of the map, actually. Because I kind of need to fight Skeletron. Instead of just focusing on that. Alright, let me waterbolt it up. I'm going to heal. 
just so the potion sickness runs out. Uh, that hand is almost dead. This one is almost dead too. So. I should really get rid of those first. Just cause. I like. Uh, I don't know if the hands actually have a drop. Let me see that. Uh, they drop. I mean, they drop stuff. They just don't drop the stuff I want. Man, I love this water bull. It's especially better if you're indoors, by the way, because it bounces around like fucking crazy. Okay, that's it. This is gonna be an easy fight now. No need to worry too much about it. Just need to be patient and kill it. Also need to play a little bit more careful than I have been. Maybe like you. I should have really bought bullets, but I don't know if I have an arms I think I do. But I am gonna use a little bit of arrows. He has less defense when he's spinning, by the way, which uh, is something you need to take into account sometimes. I like it a lot. Alright. Shoot him in the face. I actually have pretty good accuracy. So it's not bad. I mean, it's not like accuracy is a stat. I just. I'm pretty good at killing this guy. Okay, let me just do this. It hits way more times. When he's spinning, I should just really use the water bolt. When he's up there, I'll just use the bow. There you go. This is way easier than I expected. I didn't even have to heal twice. I made 30 potions and didn't even use half of them. It's not even midnight, it's all good. I got this. Alright, he's spinning, let's do this. Then a blade grabs it up. It does a bunch of damage. He's almost dead. I have a thing, so I don't I'm not gonna take I have a horse, so I'm not gonna take any fall damage. Okay, let's see if we can finish him off. And dead. There goes Mr. Skeleton. Did I get a workbench? I think they don't drop like hearts anymore, they just drop like little parts and those heal you. I think that's a 1.2.1 uh, thing. Anyways, now I can get into the dungeon, which is what we're gonna do right now. I like. What the fuck? It oh, I get it! Everything's in disguise! I just realized that. <laughs> it's because it's Halloween! Okay, this guy has a really cool thing. Everything's in disguise! Why am I so fucking stupid? Let me get this pumpkin. Alright then, let's go into the dungeon, see if what. See what we can do. Um, I, I like my murderous water bolt, and we do have one golden key, so this is all good. We are gonna rescue that bitch. That I, ca I can't remember what she's called. I really can't. 